here. They have brought a new comp to every map, wow. and safe starts things off. Yeah, off the riff. You already see it. Kill it. around through mid. Pop flash play. The timing needs to be impeccable here. Mind freeze coming through. Do they even know he's here? He's found the pick. Still a 2v2 and half under the fuse. How does Benkai find that one? And Leo not allowed the luxury of just trying to stick out the time for retake. And as Paper Rex barrel their way in and Trex goes down, this yeah, haunts straight over the top, actually finds his way onto the site. As well, just trying to anchor and lock this one down. What a transfer. Trex finding two, you've got to be joking. Off of the Prowler, do not give him this many opportunities. Where he could do tons of damage. Yeah, this is where it really shines, isn't it? For the smokes in the way, but already right around the side. Showstopper in his hands, Jinx making magic, but sure work. That's going to be the Nightfall used aggressively for Satan, just swinging into this one. Incredibly deep on them to the upper side. And off already, site. already Paper X have conditioned Guild to over rotate, and they're already abusing it with Forsaken working his way through. You might think this. Run back cat. and forth, back and forth, and Trex, well. Yeah. If Caldementa gets a little too aggressive on this one, he will surely be punished. Astral Four. The Astral Four. No way, man. He just catches the awful time. Crossfire is brutal to try and work your way into. So much to try and deal with. Can even set up. Safe, though, finding two. Forsaken just chatting out of control, honestly. Just barreling his way through. Now a bit of contact play, but he runs his way in. Showstopper as well. That was in action, I believe, Jing in mid. Left. Doesn't really get too much done with it still. It's all up to Leo. Does have the rifle, but... Fragment Nade Paper X still want to be committing this utility now. You can see them starting to swarm into the site, but they were not ready. What an outplay! Trex over the top as well. That Showstopper putting in good... He never allowing Guild to set up for a reasonable retake. They're pushing him! I mean, this is so... He's down first. Face your fear! So, Horde's gonna get destroyed though, and now his positioning is not enough. A bit of a satchel play though, Gilda fast on the approach. Trex and Leo, dynamic duo, and finally they're fine. And Russ, what perfect impeccable timing for him to take that fight into mid. Two kills gonna be claimed, he's helped out his team, but are they ready? He overextended last time, and now he's gonna be shooting in. They just walked in. As well, they have just contacted past. Mind free, holds this down, but only 13 seconds remaining. The spike, it can be denied right through the box, and Trex knows what revealed. And players are so weak on either side, but they just don't. Anticipate Leo on the bullets in the clip. The frenzy not enough for him. In fact, Benkai is the one who gets two of them still. Russ, what can he do? Only the ghost. So much pressure, but the reload in play. And Benkai with four off angles, but forsaken with a judge. When do you ever anticipate this? Right up close and personal. It's a pop flash play. Russ was ready and waiting, potentially in the anti flash position, but already forsaken getting value out of it. Haunt up close and personal with a TP behind. What? Him. Forsaken, you are an absolute maniac. Forsaken in a lot of trouble. How has he just disrespected him here? Doesn't choose to teleport away, but down, Jinx mid. got his back. Swinging off of the play still. An attempt is made by Guild, but there's a call as well that Paper X wants to throw at you. And look at this. Oh, come. One the only thing he needs is raw aim. The bottom of hell. Now the rare is going to be played just out in the open. Leo's dealt with, and Jinx already responding. The hand. No coverage from drop. Guild, they've got to try and swing this one with a bit of confidence, and that's what they've got. In spades right now, Safe picks up the two players and the defuse coming online, but here come the snake bites. Are the snake bites, where's the utility? It's there it is! Diffuse, Mind Freak's already killed one. Cold oh, Only two more bullets in the headhunter. The swing, no, Trex. He puts in enough damage. Does some good work, but ultimately, it looks like it's going to be coming up with too much. With off a nade, drop down. Leo just needs to get his gun out and support this one. Orbital Strike dropped on dropped. Mind Freak just playing outside of this one. Trades, is it going to be enough? No. Oh, the pace. What? Instantaneous, man. The slide, the dash across, and of course he gets the reset. Oh, going up. Slow up as well to try and push them across. And as the door opens up, Trex is forced and teleports back. He forgot safe. positioning, and look at this. Yep, the wraparound by safe. They know where Mind Freak is. Pressured the spat. Some big numbers still, Devi. You are really going to repeat that, Headhunter. He's ADS'd up. Given any angles. A wider swing from Mind Freak. Good damage being done. Action. This could get dangerous now for Paper X. And it's a fast play. Look at that double satchel right into the headshot. From Gil. That's the Gil that we took to this round as well. And Paper X find the opening. Kill in fact both. Leo and Coldamento dropping at holes just opens up B. And the Vipers pits more. Tried to give him a bit of covering fire, but I mean the overdrive, it's not the best weapon for the job, is it? Can't quite go through the walls, but it does enough. 
Spot. Gilda setting up for the retake. They're in already, using the blast packs to take space. Pushing forwards though. In play by PaperX, three rounds in a row. It's all going behind it and the spam through the wall. He's the one that can deny this plant. And I think he's too far away. Might just be in range, surely, with the nade. The stun to try and follow it up. Forsaken is already deep. Does get taken out. Well, that's a lot of noise being made. Into Hall. Shrek tries to take the angle and his teammate once more, Leo. Both of them get out. No way! Oh, right underneath the ropes. That's such a tiny angle, but still he will fall. They go back and deal with it. Stun over the top. Oh, a bit of Guardian spam. That's going to be two kills rewarded, though. Forsaken, no. Oh, what's more, the pace, the tempo. It's turned up a tad, but Leo more than ready to absorb all the aggression coming his way with the right. Okay, the angle, and around here, the orb goes up to try and at least deny a bit of space, but shots being missed. Divide doesn't anticipate it. Aggression by safe, and he's taken so much off for Rolling Thunder that connects onto them. And now the overdrive stuns it to stuns, but here, man, he's already here. Oh my goodness, 14 seconds left, the slow orb dropped down, the response is instantaneous. The kills left. are flooding through, Safe is able to find some significant value. Oh, Forsaken just beat! Stun force through. There's that molly and the spam because they just hit. Madness. Are we gonna come this? Stun into the corner. Oh my. In. Are they ready for it? The teleport, engage! Oh, back to safety. Call the mentor needs to try and capital in Thunder as well. That's gonna be used to disrupt that as soon as the plan noise down and Paper X, they wanna play off the back of it, damage. Oh, it's more than done. Locked back, the spike is dropped. Has to be a quick response from Gil, but it's not enough. Flooding out through drop. Oh, the reactive high ball to try and disrupt. The overdrive instantly. Oh, he's so deep. But this crossfire. Oh, the dash, the slide. Mind Freak's there to follow up, but that... They've flipped the map completely. Mind Freak still has his wall to cut these players oh. off. Just to try and stop them from getting through, but now Jing is going to start to stick this one. Pushing forward, trying to hold it. And Forsaken, well, he's going to be trying to follow up. The spam tries to predict where it might be, and while all oh, this is no going way. on, you just late lurking. This is what Benko is doing early on all the time. And Mind Freak, he has the post plan positions from there. Guild. Called him in with a great pick. That might be what Guild need, but they will not expect these players at Arcade so fast. Yeah, I mean, it's an instantaneous adaptation. On either side, they're gonna try and double swing it. They do find themselves advantage, but they don't expect Last Forsaken the late play, and now it's down to the 1v1. This is gonna be close out. A paper X is gonna be taking this series. Divide with the operator. Ross. Way for the first time in mass.